Hello friends, let's solve Google Code Jam 2020 qualification round question. First question is Westigum for 7 point and the problem is like we given a stress a matrix n cross n matrix and uh, we have to find out these uh, three things k r and c k is a stress of matrix stress means simply the sum of the diagonal element r is the number of row in a matrix that contain a repeated element and c is the number of column that has repeated element so this is sample input like uh, for this here let's say start from 4 so 4 cross 4 matrix we have a diagonal sum is 4 so that is our stress 4 then every row that has a repeated element so there are 0 rows that have repeated element so 0 and we don't have any column that have repeated element so this is 0 for this to a second test case like start from here 4 to not getting selected like uh, we have uh, 2 plus 3 plus 2 plus 2 that is 9 that is our diagonal here and uh, this row has uh, repeated element this row has a repeated element here also repeated element here 2 is also repeated so we total have 4 row that is repeated element and same for the column all the column have repeated elements so we print out 4 and same is for here so let's solve this we solve using C++ so let's say has include uh, we use our bits std C++ dot H now using std we have our main function int main okay first we have our test case is c so input of our t after that we given a matrix uh, so first we have n and then have n crosses matrix so let's say int let's say here integer n now for every test case we have to use a for loop so for i equal to 0 i is uh, less than t and i plus plus we first get input of every test case we get first n that is the size of matrix like we n cross n after get n we have to make a matrix so int call it uh, array and it is n cross n so it's a two dimensional array after that we get input for this array so we have to use two for loop for input so for j equal to 0 j is uh, less than n and j plus plus we get another for loop for integer k equal to 0 k is uh, less than n and k plus plus we get input for our rs j k element so this is how we get input of our matrix now we need to find out three things right diagonal row and columns so let's have three variables here here dia call it uh, diagonal equals zero in starting int uh, row equal 0 in starting and int uh, column equal to 0 in starting so this 3 is our output okay we can find diagonal right here while we are doing our input so we simply have condition if uh, j is equal equal to k means this is a diagonal element so we simply say diagonal equal to diagonal plus our rf j comma k element so this is how we can find out our diagonal element 
another two thing we need to find out is uh, number of row that have repeated element and number of column so for that we have to use uh, let's say we we can use has has map so we have to use here like uh, for this uh, let's say on order map which is of uh, int int type and let's say call is mp so we have an under map now we use it uh, right here for getting every input of our array element we simply like uh, for every row we can do this mp we can insert into our hash map so mp our array th, uh, j k element we simply increment it by one and uh, after completion of uh, for loop we have to simply like uh, check that uh, for let's say for auto x in mp we check uh, if our any element uh, any value is uh, greater than one it means it is repeated and we simply increment our row so like if uh, our mp x element dot uh, second we can simply add x dot second if it is greater than one it means it is a repeated number and in that case that is we have to increment our uh, variable row by one means we find out one row that have repeated element and then we do it for second row and third row and up to n row and we have to do the same thing for columns so for that we need to write another two for loops so let's say four but here we start with columns so for integer k equal to zero k is less than n and k plus plus we check for uh, for j equal to zero j, uh, j is less than n j plus plus here we have to check for every column so we have to declare first our unordered map say int int and call it mp and uh, for every year value we simply insert into our map so mp and here we get our arrow red check k element and we increment it here we do it for every columns and after every fall on inside end of this fall loop we done with our first column then we check if uh, uh, for auto x in our map we simply check if uh, x dot second is uh, greater than one means we have at least one repeated element and that means that column plus plus so we found one column and then uh, we do it for second column k equal to one and then k equal to two up to k is less than n so that's how we do for all columns and after everything uh, we have to write here after this for loop we have to print out our result so uh, this is how we can print out our result so let's say see out we 
have to write this case has and uh, this is i plus 1 because we started with i equal to 0 this and after that uh, we can have to write like diagonal then we have a space then we have uh, like uh, we have first row or we have columns we have row first then uh, we have space and then we have column and then we have end line so this is our solution let's try it for sample test cases I couldn't make it to the first round like I got only 23 points let's submit our code sample failed what mistake is there like we write something wrong four zero zero nine five five or nine four four and eight zero two okay here we got nine five five What's wrong? We have a empty. What input? Uh, Okay, we have to write here like we have to break if we find one row if we find it once then we have to break we don't have to calculate for every element we just at least we find one element that has a repeated it means our we get our row otherwise uh, let's submit our code it works three times mm -hmm. we get it correct this case passes so this is the solution of the first problem and I know the solution of second problem and I also solve third problem so I will make a video on these two and upload it so if you like this subscribe to my channel and thank you for watching guys